Hey there, welcome to Speech Help for Kids. I'm Heather, and today I have two books that I'm going to be highlighting along with a puzzle activity that I recommend. So one of my patients, a recent patient that I just got, loves construction trucks. So I went to the library and found a couple of construction truck, truck books for him and thought I would do a video and show you some ideas of how you can use trucks with your little ones. So if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on future videos. And if you have a suggestion or a comment for future videos, leave it down below and I'll try to make a video for you. So stay tuned to see construction trucks and puzzles today. All right, so this first book is called Digger Dozer Dumper. So I've actually really enjoyed this book with actually a couple of patients and have done some language and have my patients make up a story. So it could be for all different ages and not just the little ones. So this book gives a description about the dump trucks and then tells a little bit about each one in different trucks. So we've got the garbage truck, we've got a dump truck, backhoe, the skid steer loader, the excavator, that's a fun one to try to get the little ones to say, bulldozer, cement mixer, a fire truck. So this fire truck one, I've actually had them make up a story and then love doing this little puzzle with a fire truck as well. So I'll show y'all that a little bit later of puzzle suggestions. Ambulance, cherry picker, tow truck, Steam roller, forklift, semi, snow plow, and then all the trucks. So this has been a great little overview book for some of my patients, and I've used it quite a bit the past couple of weeks. So digger, dozer, and dumper. Definitely recommend that one. And then my next one is good night construction site. So my patient loved this one and talking about the trucks. And then I would ask, do they really go to sleep? And my patient says, no. In one of the pictures, the truck has a blanket. So it's got some cute pictures and things that you can talk about trucks with your little ones. I also like using this one if my patient's working on the final K sound. So having them point to their throat and making that k truck and putting that hard K at the end of the word. So that's obviously a good one. And then my last thing is doing puzzles. I, my patients love using puzzles. So this Melissa and Doug jigsaw puzzle comes with four different puzzles. So I use the fire truck. We've got a school bus, a race car, and then a train. So I love the Melissa and Doug set comes with the four different pieces to each of the puzzles and they have different shapes on the back so that you know which one goes to the puzzle so you can have your child work on sorting those shapes out, counting, talking about the different transportation. So this has been something fun that I've enjoyed this past week with my patients. So working on that final K if it's Arctic and then the construction books. So. Thanks for watching. If you haven't already, subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on future videos. And if you have a suggestion or a comment, leave it down below and I'll try to make a video for you. Thanks for watching.